there are so many people I know who may be skeptical of the law of attraction, law of vibration, being in harmony with the things that you want in life. In the book, you talk about how you know, Bob was in Colorado at the exact same time when they were filming The Secret. Right. An incredible example of law of attraction. Can you share with our listeners an example in your life where you attracted the right opportunity, the right person, or the right circumstance? Oh, well, there's a good question. Um, well, if you want a law of attraction kind of a crazy story, um, I'll, I'll give it to you. I, I've always been big on vision boards. And one of the things on my vision board was an old car, an Austin Heel. And I started talking to him and the price was really up there. I'm sure, it was in mint condition, you said, It, it right? was in mint condition. I mean, you could eat off the motor, like it just rolled off the line. I did the one thing that I knew if I did, it would, it would get me to jump. I called my father. <laughs> I sent him some pictures of the car. I was telling him why I shouldn't at the time. He says, well, those are all reasons why you shouldn't or you can't. But why don't you think about how you can or why you should? He says, you know, so often we don't treat ourselves well. Um, he said, you need to go and do this for yourself. I thought, gosh, I, it'd be nice to get the British Heritage Certificate on this car. I, so I called him up and I said, hey, can you email that to me just so I have something to kind of look at, uh, you know, until the car gets delivered to me. When I opened this up, the certificate, and I started to read it, the car started to be built on December 8th, 1961, my actual birthday. Wow. I mean, you cannot make that up. Right. So, you know, you want a law of attraction uh, message. There's one right there for 